Okay, this will be a simple tutorial on how to use Audacity to record your World Truth radio shows. Uh, what you're looking at here is the general interface of Audacity. Very simple program. And to get started here, first thing you want to do is click on Edit, go to Preferences, and select your audio devices. Make sure you're on devices up here. Then uh, check your host interface. I use MME, and uh, that's probably going to work out the best for you. And your playback isn't really going to matter for this, but the recording is. So you just select the device you're going to record from. I use Stereo Mix. That way, if I play music or some, some other audio besides my vocal, it will record it that way. If you have that ability, use that. Uh, if you don't, you might just have to go with your microphone. But uh, I use the stereo mix. That gives me both anything coming through the sound card and through the microphone. And then you select whether or not you want stereo or mono. I use stereo just in case I do play some additional audio. I set my project rate down here at 22,050. You can select other rates if you want, but that seems to work out very well for doing audio recordings of voice. Then you come up here and you click the record button and you'll see the little scroll bar moving across and it'll have a little graph of your voice showing the levels of your voice as it moves along and so you record your show whatever it is however long it's going to be an hour comes out to about 20 megabytes at my settings uh, so anyway just go ahead and record that and then once you're done just click the stop button and at that point in time you can click up here on file go to export and then at this point, you type in a name that you want it to be. I'm going to go ahead and record it over this other one that I already did there, which is Test 1. Uh, you have an Options button that you can select different things as far as how you're going to export it to. Uh, I use a variable bit rate, a 9 quality, fast speed, and joint stereo. You can modify that or play with that, but those settings work fine. Say OK there. Click Save. It'll bring up... Uh, a, a box that asks about your metadata, which means what are the tags in your MP3 file going to look like. So you can put your name under artist name and uh, whatever you want to call your show. I do, do, do these for my daily news show, so it's always going to be labeled that. and uh, Just the various other tags that you have there available. Once you're done, click OK, and it resaves that, that file to your hard drive. That's it. Pretty simple, eh? Alrighty.